Thanks for joining us. I'm introducing you to the Internet of Things and to machine-to-machine -machine applications. Internet of Things means billions of connected devices exchanging tons of data mainly for the purpose of remote monitoring and control. Key applications area are automotive, consumer devices, security, asset management. That means almost all of the industries can benefit from machine-to-machine -machine applications to address new business model, to increase the revenue, to improve the efficiency and to cut the operational cost. Here we have one of the key applications of machine-to-machine -machine in the automotive segment. This is a smart vehicle tracking system based on the GPS GLONASS. Today, navigation and tracking solutions are widely used all over the world for, rem for remote vehicle diagnostic, for uh, emergency calls, uh, usage-based insurance as pay as you drive. The design consists of a vehicle unit to be installed inside the vehicle and a remote web application that displays the location and status. Uh, the onboard unit is built around an STM32 F2 series microcontroller. There is a TSO2 module that collects GPS GLONASS information, geographical coordinates, date, time and speed, and send over GPRS thanks to a SIM card that is especially designed for machine-to-machine -machine applications with a wider temperature range and an extended data retention. The, the remote web applications displays the current location and status and same data are reported on a graphical LCD display. The board is even equipped with the three MEMS sensors, temperature sensor, a three-axis accelerometer and the yo pitch roll gyroscope for crash lift detection. In case of crash, the board sends an SMS to the administrator for assistance and rescue. Let's simulate an SMS. So the boarding sent the SMS with information on geographical coordinates. Thanks to the sensors, many other services can be implemented, such as dead reckoning to locate uh, the vehicle where no satellite coverage, or for driver profiling for risk assessment. For more info, visit www.st.com. Thanks for your attention.